Uh, so welcome back to, to Super Mario Odyssey. Jesus Christ, I haven't been recording forever. Sky Garden, okay. We will have to. Yeah, I think it will have to here. Damn it! I <laughs> I forgot how to rest, please. <laughs> the perfect outfit. Anyways. Recent events of him said my panic has been routine, panic has been. What's the plan? Okay. Well. Well, what is there to say? Welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey. I haven't played this in forever. I haven't played on my own time. And, well, spoiler alert. I think, uh. I think uh, I hold Mario Galaxy in a higher standard than Odyssey, but that doesn't mean that Odyssey isn't a fun game. It's really fun, but I think it's more to play it like uh, in your own spare time rather than let's playing it. Anyways, Jesus, all this shaking. What's up, my dude? Reading traveler to you and your head as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does the monster want from this kingdom? Just give me a second. Flowers. You're correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. I forgot to set my timer. So, well. Oh, I hate that. I hate this stunt. It's just too much. It's... Hold on, I think there's something... Oh. Alright, this little push to me. Alright, you got it, Cappy. I just think there's something wrong with the television. I think the center area is looking more darker than the bottom on top half. You're not going to notice this on the recording. Because God damn it, it's, it's not exactly too yearing, but it's certainly notable. Well, you, you let me worry about that. Anyways, welcome to Planet Wisp. I mean, um, <laughs> the Wooded Kingdom. There's not a lot of wood, though. Whatever. So, what I'm going to do with Super Mario Odyssey is just uh, speed run it. Because, I don't know. So, shit, I mean, god, <laughs> I should be sweating, at least not on this game, so, uh, so, oh jeez, <laughs> I haven't been recording anything in a while, like, I could barely upload, but not in the red maze, that's, well, whatever, I'm not going to say anything, <laughs> I mean, since I began on the school on on January, at the beginning, I don't know, I don't have time for anything. This semester is just too much. I'm, I'm not liking anything. Oh, I'm not liking anything of it. And I don't know how to feel about it. I'm sorry, I'm just moping again. But that's pretty much what, <laughs> what we do on this channel more with playing video games we just go hand in hand <laughs> they shouldn't I don't know how would have we point I just love that we stuck with the super you know? and that's it I have I don't believe I have gotten more acquainted with the controls oh jeez I swear I hope that wasn't the case. Yeah, I mean, it's like the middle of the TV screen. It's not as lighting up as the bottom part of the, uh, the under part. Whatever. Flower TV of the Sky Garden. I wasn't sure if I wanted to record the Odyssey, but I was like, what else could I record? Bayonetta? Neat, we can use that to get across. Oh, Bayonetta would have been a nice option, but... I don't know, uh, maybe. <laughs> but it's not that, but I mean... Maybe, maybe I wait for the Switch Edition. 
because I don't want to be... Oh, I'm going to unpack my Switch with the dock and everything and then just, <laughs> just pack the Wii U on, on the recording room per se. Anyways, so, so I'm on the second semester of my, uh, I don't know, BA of English teaching, whatever. To be an English teacher. And I, I'm too confused. I don't know how to say it. Uh, here's what happened. The first day, it was from 7 to 5, like 7 in the morning to 5 in the evening. Uh, it's just... Eh. Not, it's not fun times. It's not all days like that, but I certainly... I'm not fan of it. That's what I can tell you. Mm. Yeah. He's gonna smash the wall. <laughs> what, a, what a thing to say in the Mexican outfit. Whatever. <laughs> okay, stop. So, yeah, I mean... Oh, I'm gonna mess up. I'm not paying too much attention. Sorry, let me focus for a second. You are, uh, I need you. So, I don't know, I mean, so I went the first day, then on the second one I got like really sick, I wanted to vomit, so I didn't win. And I think they explain a lot of the course material and everything on the second day. And I'm trying to trying to, you know, finding finding sense in everything <laughs> in life itself. Okay, but uh, I think I can shake this thing and yeah. Well, the thing is, I don't know, the first semester, it was on the uh, evening class. Like, I, I was taking classes from 3 to 8 in the evening on the first semester. And it was okay. I mean, my classmates were pretty swell people. But for the second semester, my friends decided, hey, let's go to the morning classes. And I'm like, okay, let's do that. Even though we will be on the new group. Uh, I'll explain, but it was a bad idea. <laughs> it's just terrible all around. Two late chums, we snagged the Suar bouquet already. Now, why don't you scram? We can grab the rest of the flowers as well, or maybe I'll make you scram. Alright, this guy is relatively simple. But I'm... Okay, what's going on? <laughs> relatively simple and... Yeah, you're just getting smacked. Okay, well... I don't know, is there lag on the screen? I think just the same as the Wii U, but just a little, not too much. And well, let's let's uh, well, let me explain. I don't know what's wrong with the people in the morning class. It's like they don't talk to each other. It's like they hate each other. They don't say it, but they just <laughs> hate each other. And um, here's the fun thing, or more like the interesting detail. I mean, you you can draw your own conclusions, conclusions. But I mean, my friends, they they are mostly girls. It's like four girls, one guy. And and we get along. But in the morning, like no one talks to each other. There's this weird stagnant air. I mean. The people there have their own groups, like four or five people, but it's not like they don't talk to each other. It's like, again, it's like they hate each other. And we don't know if it's exactly something that's happening, like they hate each other or anything, but it just looks like that. Back to the secret flower field, okay. And I don't know, I know the teachers feels really stereotypical. It's kind of a weird thing to say, but did, it, like, did I see something just land up there? Well, kind of cappy. And I don't know. It's just they just feel stereotypical. It's like it's it's just pretty much the description of what a teacher does. They just go give class, kind of do their thing, and that's that's it. Yeah, yeah, they. 
<laughs> we can get a Rick and Morty outfit, okay. Uh, let's just get this one. The Saber, <laughs> Saber Wolf outfit. So, I don't know, so... Uh, all the classes feel the same. And... That's not a good thing. <laughs> I mean, I remember on the evening... Every teacher had, like, their own personality, their own way to do things, they had their own quirks, they felt like characters, like, they, they, they were, like, predictable in a sense, you could predict what they would do, what they would think. Or feel, yeah, okay. And, but, and we talk with those teachers, like, oh, Jesus, <laughs> the war zone, okay. And we would talk with those teachers, and... They will talk with us and all that. And, you know, there was like a reciprocal or whatever it's called interaction. However, in the morning, there's nothing. <laughs> just the teacher comes and, hey, what's up? Uh, yeah, this, this, and that, and bye, bye, people. And that's it. I mean, for example, on one of the classes, the teacher always asks questions. No one answers, and she just continues the class. It's kind of weird because on the on the evening class, if something like that were to happen, like the teacher will ask a question and and uh, and no one answers, the teacher will, will say, "Guys, what's going on? Is everything okay?" Ah, oh, no! <laughs> I'm missing my bonus, and oh Jesus, that's not looking great. Uh, we're going to go deep underground. I don't know, in this area. I don't like a lot of fairies in this game, but we'll get to that later. Anyway, so, yeah, they will do something like that. And, yeah, there will be like some sort of interaction, but not here, it's like they don't care. So, I'm kind of confused, because I, I don't even know how the teachers are going to score anything. It's like, are we doing homework? Are we doing anything at all? Because I don't feel like we're doing anything. We just go and the teacher talks and nothing happens. I mean, I don't know, it's kind of weird. It's kind of depressing, <laughs> even. I mean, we even agreed, me and my friends too, next semester we'll go back to the evening classes. Because mm, it's, not, it's, not, it's not great. Because in the evening class, like our group, Oh look, it's a freaking dinosaur <laughs> with a freaking head. I just care Mario or just cold. Alright. Oh, <laughs> we have these flowers. Anyways. So yeah, we're on from the dinosaur. Cool, cool wins, right? Yay. <laughs> I don't know, I'm not impressed. This guy gives a lot of coins. And, I don't know, I'm not feeling, I'm not really feeling it, I guess that's what I can say, say. Uh, I don't know, I mean, normally on the, on the evening, I could like, joke with my t-shirts, talk with them. On this one, I don't know, I feel like they just run away before I can, I can even talk. And let me say this. Since since this is what I what I could say my second run through college, I don't I don't I'm not scared of of the teachers like I don't have the fears that I had when I when I first when I first what did I say when I had my first uh, BA in graphic design and animation like normally it's like oh this this is a weird place I don't know and right now it's like I don't care. <laughs> I don't have to say, it's not like I don't care, it's just that I don't have fear to ask questions or something or be more, uh, I don't know, open with the teachers I mean, of course, some teachers might be close and they don't want to talk or they feel like they have to completely play the paper of teacher and student and all that I, I don't buy it, I'm sorry, I, I don't buy it <laughs> I'm tired of that shit <laughs> I'm tired of pretending of pretending stuff. I mean, we're all people just pretending to be something that we're not. That's the way I see it. 
And in fact, that's what I told one of the teachers in the evening because she was kind of like, at first she was like too, too. What do I say? Rude? I don't know. I don't. I don't think that's a word. But she was like more closed. But then one day, like she felt really bad, like she had low pressure. But we all gathered like to help her, and that's when I told the well teacher, "Don't." Because she was like, oh, I'm so embarrassed, guys. It's, it's, it's embarrassing. Well, we flew over the fire. Sure, we did. And I was like, no, oh, these are we're just, we're just people pretending to be something else. And after that, they should open up a little bit more. And I'm glad. Because I also think that, well, it's responsibility of the teacher to provide the students with a proper um, ambience, like, of, of trust. I don't believe it's also responsibility of the group to allow the teacher to to do that because I mean we can just shift responsibility just say no this is someone else's responsibility but if one if we, if we can do something I don't believe we should do it like give the teacher the space to be more open because I'm tired of stereotypes I'm tired of of the same bullshit every day I mean, I, w I mean, you know I work at a call center, I got tired of that, of doing the same thing every day. I must say, I guess that's why I really like graphic design. Because, I mean, of course I use the same software sometimes, but I'm always doing something else. I'm doing something new. That's what I like about graphic design. Where am, where am I supposed to go? Uh, not paying attention, I'm so sorry, but at least no matter where we go, we're getting something. Okay, let's do it. Where do I have to go? I mean, I know it's at the top, but whatever. Anyways, so yeah, I'm not really liking this MS, I'm not really feeling it. Then, then of course, as always. Oh wait, this is not gonna work out. Uh, please respond, okay. I don't want to go back to Jurassic Park down there. Anyway, so mm, I think I can. All right, but <laughs> I don't think this is what I, where we want to go right now. Yeah, but we can get a, a power moon, whatever. The nut around the corner. Mm. Yeah, this <laughs> this is not the proper <laughs> terminology for this day and age. Anyways, so yeah, and and here's and one of the classes. There's this teacher, like she's pretty old, <laughs> and she's unnecessarily strict. And here's the thing: what I try to do is I try to get a read on teachers because I want to I want to be able to predict them <laughs> how to react, how they do react, and all that. And this one is kind of predictable because I think she's really strict, but she's kind of like she's kind of like just playing a paper of being a strict. But I don't know how to say it. She gets strict for for just dumb reasons <laughs> or things that she shouldn't be doing. She shouldn't be getting mad. Okay, let's say for example, or more like let me tell you what she does. She's like you guys should be no should know about this, and she flips because we don't know and I'm like why <laughs> if I knew <laughs> I, w I wouldn't be taking the classes so can we really skip the bullshit and, and and tell me what I'm doing wrong what I'm doing right I mean there's a timeline of the time you take to tell to just being dismissive and tell me I'm an asshole and then there's the timeline where where you actually teach me what I'm doing wrong and I learned to not do it. Or, or she's like, guys, I told this yesterday. And I'm like, yeah, in a one hour class, which we have seven in the entire day. You said one thing in a one hour class, and then we have other classes, and then we also have lives. Of course, teachers love to pretend that, that students don't have lives because they are young or whatever. Well, that's just a bullshit cop-out. I, I don't buy it. I'm too old for this shit. I'm 25. 
<laughs> here's my... <laughs> Here's, here's my terminology. Skip the bullshit, just tell me the facts. I mean, of course I'm not perfect. But I don't do I don't do things wrong on purpose be because of whatever. I do them because I don't know how to do them right. And that's that, and it just bothers me. And that's the other thing, like... She, like, she gets really sweet. With the, with the students that are passing by outside the class, and I'm like, uh, there's something weird here. So I don't think she's a bad person, but it's just she does that for what reason? Maybe just to start getting a, uh, I don't know, just to set the mood of the class so everyone pays attention or something. I mean, she she probably thinks that everyone is just a bunch of kids out of out of high school, which she's right. But I'm not! <laughs> it's weird. So that's pretty much what's going on. And like I said, a lot of the class, are, I'm not really feeling them. It's like, they, they all feel the same. It's like this just blob of the same. They have no personality or heart or whatever. And yeah, I'm not really liking it. I'm just... I, a lot of the time I just wake up and think, do I want this? <laughs> I'll be honest, no, I don't want it. <laughs> I don't want to be a teacher. <laughs> I like the idea of being one. But going through all the process, I mean, of course, it's important to be... Uh, to be competent. But... But I don't know. He's, he, because... I mean... I'm doing it because I think, well... It's a good job in the end. It's sustainable. It's not like it's not like a uh, time changing or whatever because graphic design is a difficult job to get, but a really good one if you get it. But you need to be good. Ah, this television, I swear. Look, you're not going to see it on the recording. You know, maybe I can recreate what it looks like. It's going to put it on the screen right now. It's kind of again. It's not like the end of the world, but it's kind of annoying. <laughs> More like it shouldn't be like that. Defend this, the secret flower field. So yeah, that's has what has been going right now. I'm not a fan of it. Looks like the secret flower field is just through here already. Sure. And well, that's so far. And I don't know. I'm thinking maybe I should for the next semester, whatever happens, I'm just gonna get a. I'm just going to look for a graphic design job. And, and maybe take it more easy on, on the college classes, maybe take a few and, and just go working. Go working, go to work. Flowers, flowers, we have all the flowers. Don't mess with me, Vipers. Damn. Oh, it's gonna be damn. Huh. I mean, I guess it's, it's duh, but I've been playing this game a lot in handheld mode. And I guess on on dark mode, there's a lot more details on screen, like additional effects and all that. Alright. By the way, I really like Happy. Because they could easily make a really annoying character, just for the sake of making him an annoying character. But Cappy is a really nice guy. He's a nice dude. He's a companion that is good to have. So that's my life right now. So, again, you know, maybe I should try to focus on what I want. And here's what I want. I want to make video games. <laughs> I want to work as a graphic designer. So maybe just need to focus on that because I do feel I'm really unhappy and the solution is more sh more simple than I make make it out to be. Because I guess what I do is what I'm doing is just what is expected of me to do, but I don't do what I want to do. And not to the point where it's like I want to do something like this, I don't care about the rules. It's like I I mean you at one point you just gotta wonder what you just gotta do with your life. 
Why am I using? <laughs> Why am I using Super Mario Odyssey to talk about this? <laughs> Whatever. Twenty three minutes in, and we're already finishing this area. Well, it's going fast. We're going to need one more moon, but uh, moons are really easy to get in this game. So, yeah, I mean... I should guess... Ah, oh, it's just most notable. I swear, what's wrong with this? What's wrong with the television? Hmm, smell those flowers. <laughs> I still believe we can actually buy one, right? Oh, wait, what? Yo, that's so cool. Anyway, so that's my life right now. That's what I think I'm doing. Spend money. <laughs> Thank you, my dude. Hmm. Spend money, yeah. Yeah, I think we can just get one. Thank you for your coins. Yeah, thank you for the moon. That's it. Spend it, it looks like as the week of whatever next kingdom. <laughs> you can read it faster than than what I can read it. I mean on my mind I can read it properly, but you know talking at the same time. <laughs> it's different. Oomp. There she has powered up. So, uh, we can go to the Lake Kingdom now. Maybe we catch up with Bowser there. I must say, I don't like these kingdoms. I don't like, I don't like the kingdoms in this game, and I don't know exactly why. But I, Jesus, it always scares me because I, I hold the controller with. I hold both controllers with both hands, then I move one, and I forget I have the strap on, so I just pull it. Eh. <laughs> and it's like, oh shit. I mean, oh no. Anyways. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't really like the, the words of this game. I don't think they're precious, so our bouquet stolen. We can let that poster keep doing whatever he wants. Seeing a host, how we got some time to kill, let's review some useful skill. Spin throw. You just take this thing on the sides, yep. So... Yeah, I don't like the kingdoms in this game, I don't I don't know why. They feel... generic. Which is kind of a weird thing to say, because I mean, look at this, this is really nicely designed. But I don't know why. I mean... Jesus, I don't know. I guess that's a problem. Not liking something, <laughs> I, I, I don't know exactly why. It's trying to be too hard to get them. Look at these awesome skills. Whoa, oh, great jump, thanks, Cappy. Oh, jeez! Alright. Alright. I wonder if we can get the brutals. Maybe. I mean, I did... When I played this, I did the pretty generic playthrough. Nothing too fancy. Oh cool, look at all these coins. End of the hidden passage. <laughs> so just end, end of the hidden passage. That's it. Oh wait, there's something over here. It kind of looks like, but no. Ah, but the music is so calm, so I don't know what's my complaint. I mean, the game is good, but I don't know, I just think I like Galaxy better. I think I'm just gonna buy it. Yeah, ouch. <laughs> just never have to worry about air. 
uh, <laughs> I guess if they are out of the water, they do have to worry about the air. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, what's up? She looks distressed. I can't stand that monster. Their spile henchman, this taller, beloved, lush lady dress. Don't worry, we can get it back. Hmm. Alright, this goes. Yeah, this goes to the. To the left. And we kind of want to go to the right. But whatever. Wait. Da -da 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 -da. Taking notes in the cliffside. Alright. Simple stuff. Cliffside. Cliff. Jeff Cliff. Oh no! What's being flat? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Whatever. Come on. There will be time enough for that, believe me. <laughs> oh no, don't put it over there. So, I mean, what I really like this game. Don't don't get me wrong. I mean, as you have as you have seen, I have been doing some pretty out of the ordinary uh, jumps. And this is not to, like, say, oh, I'm the best Super Mario player. No, this is, like, you can play this game casually, and there's no problem with that. And you can also play, like, with a bit more uh, tricky jumps and everything. And the game allows you for that. It's not forcing you to do it one way or another. If you can imagine it, you can do it. Oh, well, let's go here. Hmm, the one to do this right now. Well, whatever, let's do it. I, I, I was. Blah, blah, blah. Why do I do that? I don't know. Well, I was just checking if there was something behind. So I was trying to render an episode of Breath of the Wild and one for Left 4 Dead. But the Breath of the Wild episode was taking forever to to render. I don't know why. It was like if my computer wasn't using the video card to render. How do I know this? Because when I render with the video card, like the Radeon one, the computer fan makes a lot of noise, like a lot of noise. But when I was rendering the episode, it wasn't making noise. Normally, what I do... On the on when I'm rendering on day, I use the video card. It makes a lot of noise, but there's no problem with that. But at night, uh, when everyone is sleeping, I just render it with the uh, with the integrated uh, Intel video card. It doesn't make a lot of noise, but it takes it doesn't make noise, but it takes a lot a lot of time to render. So it's, it's a good and a bad one. I mean, there's the Admon, but where's the other? Oh boy! <gasps> no! Okay, let's just pick the moon and, <laughs> and then we'll figure out whatever. I don't want to be doing all that. I must say, the, the visual design of the war is kind of interesting. It looks like... Like, really printed. Oh, it looks like sandstone. That's probably it. Pretty, pretty cool. Pretty cool, nonetheless. Well, we're going to get the multi moon from the rulers then. Ah, stupid, stupid mini Goomba. Then we see where we get the other one. Hurrah! I was talking about something important. Well, the render. It was taking forever to render Breath of the Wild. It was taking like more than eight hours. <laughs> and I kinda want to use the computer. <laughs> You're too late. We already got the lush lady dress. And it even matched the boss to zero, so no way we're giving it back. <laughs> it's going loud. Oh shit, I'm not. 
I'm not doing any inputs because I'm looking at the computer. Just to make sure it's not freezing or anything. Wait, will, will that be bad news? Ah. One day he's gonna stop. <laughs> Time to die Kung Lao. <laughs> ah, damn it. Well, I need to be more careful. Besides, he's not hes not doing anything too complicated, so I'll take it easy. And that's it. Oof, he's dead. <laughs> and it's just like in Mortal Kombat, they're going to bring him back. From the nether realm or whatever. I don't know anything really about Mortal Kombat uh, lore. It doesn't matter because we got a multi moon. And you can see the day where I'm recording this. Perfect. It's uh, 1 14 in the morning. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What about those two? Let's go after them. Yeah, we need a couple moons, Cappy. But uh, getting moons is really easy. You see? On the lake shore. Alright. Again, I think this game is kind of shield to be playing on a let's play. <laughs> or should I say, it's kind of open ended. <laughs> so, I don't know. I'm not saying it's a bad game to let's play, but I don't know. Um, just see, I'm just seeing where I can get one more and just just get it over with. Maybe. Oh well. Let's swim together. Not right now, Doris. Dory, bag rider. Hmm. This game, though, I don't like using the teleport. I, I feel the worlds aren't like that big to worry about that, and it takes more time. <laughs> you know, I'm thinking of actually playing Super Mario Galaxy for this channel. <laughs> I mean, I still have my Wii U. I just want to sell it, but there's there's no buyers. <laughs> Maybe I should just lower it a little. To the Metro Kingdom. Yeah, we just have to cross the entire ocean. We're just blasting through this war. It's only been like 36 minutes. <laughs> Can we finish the game on this night? Ah, I don't think so. I don't think so. I mean, I do believe I do believe I'm pretty good, but not that good. <laughs> Whoever heard of a wedding with a stolen dress? Let's get after that deckless fiend. See, so yeah, how we got some time to kill is reveal some useful skill. Nothing that you haven't seen before. Goodness, what was that? There they are! Time to get busy. Boy, Mario's, Mario's eyes were a solid tail of that shot. Yo! Call Kingdom. <laughs> hey, do you want to solve some business? Yeah, you park the car. Park the car! <laughs> okay, let's get busy. 
I'm kind of forgetting that if you shake the controller, Capi does an additional boost to hit whatever you missed. Oh. Yeah, Bowser's gonna big. Who are you? I don't have time for you. I'm busy playing my wedding. Do you know how stressful that is? Hmm. I'll send you flying. What? <laughs> Bowser with the Markiplier hair, nice. <laughs> Whatever. Yo, I love. I mean, this is pretty. <laughs> it's pretty dope. Oh, send you flying. <laughs> Here's your ticket. <laughs> What's he going to do? Oh, nothing to worry about. I mean, the vi the final fight took me a couple of attempts. Also, <laughs> let's bail. <laughs> Time to bail. Good old fashioned TV. Oh boy. Oh, come on. No. There we go. No <laughs> 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 shit. <laughs> Holy, <laughs> that worked out. Man, bitch is just along for the ride. That's kind of an, an overused joke, but come on. Fire! He took the guns out! <laughs> <laughs> See what your game's up, Mario. Damn! Well, there's no missing around this time. <laughs> <laughs>